Do you feel a need to show a casual Muslim who does not agree with homophobia or death for apostates or hudud or wife beating what Islam really says and try to deconvert them? Yes. Yeah. Oh, I, okay. I, I, this I, is I, a cat. This is like an entire episode. Here, I, I'll throw the question back at you. If somebody believes in, wait, let me get this right. Astrology, right? Yes, astrology. Yeah. Um, do you feel the need to tell them that the, what they believe is is bullshit? Yes, I do. Even though there's no wars committed in the name of zodiac signs, right? Whenever you you fight bad ideas, you fight falsehood, you fight misinformation, no matter what it is and no matter the consequences because at the end of the day the more the more false beliefs people have um the the shittier their lives are going to be actually i should not say no matter the consequences i'm just saying no matter the immediate consequences because in general if people live based on nonsense on average is it's not good for the world if more people live their lives based on reality the world would be a better place. You have to encourage skepticism. You have to encourage people looking for evidence. You have to encourage critical thinking. If you allow harmless beliefs without evidence, you're also opening the door for harmful beliefs without evidence. The, the, the critical thinking is the only filter you could introduce pe to people. If you don't, if you remove that filter, where, what else control do you have on where these beliefs land? Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim-majority countries, advocating for atheists, secularists, and Enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash sjme.